and now I'm now I'm dehydrated. But I'll like come on. Come on. Dun dun. Not that close. That's it. I guess. Uh huh. I need water. Mm. All of my water. Where's my water? Walk like an angel. Talk like an angel. Yo, mm -hmm. oh, the devil, bruh. This is like the second time I'm trying to record this video because the first time the audio didn't work because I'm an idiot. Now I understand. Well, today I learned. <clears throat> now I understand what the slate thing is for. I think it's to align sound and audio or sound and visual. So at the clap, the sound is rolling and the camera is rolling, and you can sync that up. At the, I, I, that's just a theory. I don't know. <sighs> Dude, I've been up I don't know. I've been up since 5.30 in the morning and don't give me that thing of like, oh, I wake up at 5 a.m. and we didn't go to work. I don't care. People have different times of waking up. I'm fine waking up at 9-ish to do my stuff in the day, okay? I just don't function at 5 a.m. in the morning. Congratulations for you if you do that, but it's not a competition, okay? I don't know why I'm getting so worked up about this. Anyway, that's not why I Listen, listen! Bruh, guess who I heard on the radio today? Look! I'm good to go, I'm diving, you know I blow up. Let's go! Cause I'm in the stars tonight. So we bring the fire, set the night alight. Shining through the city with a little funk and soul. Wanna light it up like dynamite. BTS was playing on a regular American radio station, or was I supposed to just find out for myself? Because that's what just happened. My goodness. That was a treat. I mean, I kind of... K-pop was already playing on major station, I guess, because they had Blackpink's ice cream. But, come on. That was dynamite. That was cool, man. Granted, the lyrics are basic conglomeration of American pop song, but like, <sighs> that's so funny. That was a good treat. That was that was top notch. Well done. Congratulations, boys. You made it. I guess if that's a standard, making it on American radio, general standard indication that you've made it in. America in the song industry. Goodness gracious me. I need gas. Nah, I'll leave it for another day. I'll leave today's problems to tomorrow's me. Thanks, Saitama, for the awesome advice. I mean, congratulations. I, I'd never heard them on, on, on mainstream like that before. Hello. Uh, although, I mean, it's dynamite, but <laughs> the song is dynamite, but also uh, Who made that meme of the opening sounding basically like Rebecca Black's Friday? <laughs> like, how old do you have to be to remember that thing? Because I remember that. I also remember her uh, less comical music video Saturday, which I kind of liked unironically, so Whatever. Uh, sure. Don't judge me But yeah, um Dude, I was driving back to work and Dynamite came on the radio and it's different hearing K-pop 
in American mainstream. Well, I mean, there, I did hear Blackpink a couple weeks ago on the radio for the first time. Uh, but you know, I haven't been listening to the radio much because pandemic, so there hasn't been much work, so I haven't been driving a lot of places, but recently I have been, so I guess that's why I was able to hear it. Kudos to Blackpink and Selena Gomez, I guess. But also, uh, BTS on B96 in Chicago. Wow. I mean, look, I'm not ARMY, but they got good music. And they're fire dancers, so... Congrats to them, I guess. I mean, I mean, it's, 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 you don't see it in American media, and although Samsung Galaxy just dropped that, is it Samsung Galaxy? They just dropped that commercial recently, and by recently, I mean they've been playing it for at least a couple weeks, unless I've been missing, because I haven't been watching a lot of regular TV with commercials either. But listen, every time that commercial comes on TV with the phone and dynamite playing in the background, I crank that up! It's it's a it's a jam, okay? And yes, I sing along unashamedly. Oh, it's good. I mean, I was thinking I hear them on TV all the time. I should hear them on the radio and then they appeared on the radio. Today, the YouTube channel for Samsung Galaxy also dropped that uh those commercial series, the commercial series with them. With the what is it? Uh something with the baking the perfumist or whatever what do you say how do you call people that make perfume the thing with the perfume and the tailor the odd tailor or something i don't remember those were fun they were cute Aw, bruh good for them it is a bop it's a basic american bop no not not no disrespect okay don't don't come at me i did not send for you do not come at do, do not but it's catchy and i like the beat and it's uplifting even if the lyrics don't quite make sense sometimes, I... <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna be broke soon. <laughs> I just got paid and Amazon just had their Prime Day, so... You know. This is not a retail therapy video. Yet. But, you know, like, half of my stuff came in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh lord have mercy on my soul I'm a bad bad girl don't be scared yeah I have a problem I need help help me <laughs> I have a serious spending problem Oh my goodness. See, I spent I spent way too much money on Amazon on Prime Day because literally the day before Prime Day happened, I got paid. Okay? <laughs> and my brain thinks, okay, this is going into savings, this is going into checking, this is going to be paying off your credit card bills. You know what you should do with the leftover stuff? <laughs> Buy more stuff! Seriously, need help. Oh my goodness. Wait, half of my stuff came in. What? What? I... <laughs> Lord, forgive me. Yes. Delivered today, delivered today. Del arriving Sunday, arriving Monday, arriving Monday, arriving October 27th. That's fine. I don't really. Whatever. I spent way more than I. I mean, even today, I went out and spent more money. I was driving back from work, jammed out to dynamite. And instead of going home, I went straight to Target. Because I needed conditioner, I needed tea, and I picked up candy. And I needed tea because, look, you know how, if you're from, what is this, the Midwest, you're familiar with Jewel and Target. I don't know. Like, they don't have Jewel out somewhere. We went somewhere and we didn't, they didn't have a Jewel over there. They'd never even heard of it. In America! And part of my, I, it didn't register that there's specific store chains for specific parts of the country. I did not know that. Anyway, you know how Jewel has their signature select brand and Walmart has their great value brand or whatever? Well, Target has, I did not know this, their good and gather brand or something? It's like their new flagship brand? I don't know. I've been away from society for a while, so I did not notice this. Anyway, I really like peppermint tea. I like drinking it in the evening before I go to sleep. 
I went and I it was it was a, it's cheap, so and I thought, mm, well, if it's cheap, how good can it really taste? It says organic, so I bought that and I brought the Earl Grey. The Earl Grey tasted like Earl Grey, okay. But Target's brands, mint or peppermint or spearmint, I don't know what kind. It was supposed to be like a mint thing. I opened the bag. It smelled like mint. I put it in the cup. Add the hot water. It sort of smelled like mint, and then I... But it also smelled... It was, like, it was like a tea bag that was trying to smell like mint, but instead it just smelled like the lesser version of a freshly cut lawn. Not in a bad way, but also it's tea that's supposed to be peppermint or mint or whatever. And then I drank it and there was like barely any mint. So, you know, I, I, so I went back today and I had to buy more tea. That's not that brand. What did I buy? What's the thing? Tazel or something? I don't know what the brand name is. I bought a different brand because I thought maybe I got a bad box of tea, but then I thought, wouldn't the problem just be with one tea bag instead of the entire box? That doesn't make any sense. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Anyway. Yeah, bought hair conditioner because my hair is getting long and I go through giant bottle conditioner. Ah, uh, look at that. My hair is so nice. So nice. I did, I, I did some nice stuff to it yesterday. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm gonna try straightening it soon. Which I've never done before in my life on my own. My salon days have been long gone. This could either go really well, or it could go mediocre, or I could be like one of those unfortunate souls who burns their hair off with a straight iron. Either way, I'll make sure to try and film some of it. <laughs> oh, I'm scared. I'm scared, and I don't like having hot things close to my head. Even as a child, when I go to the salon, I remember when they get that flat iron or the curling iron out, and they got close to my head. It was like someone was breathing down my neck like I was being chased by a serial killer or something. Like, oh! I don't like it. I don't like it because that's like a you're very vulnerable. Someone holding a hot iron to the back of your skull. <laughs> no. Yeah. Spent way too much money. I will do a retail therapy video on all of these. Now the question is, do I open all of them or do I open half of them and then open the other half? Some of the purchases are pretty normal and others are more exciting. Oh, I cannot wait for that to arrive. <laughs> gonna be so good. <laughs> Man, I'm so glad I, I, <laughs> I felt so guilty. I returned some of them because I didn't need those biker shorts, however cute they were. I did not need those fairy lights. Well, I'm kind of wishing I had them now. <laughs> Should I order them? <laughs> Related to items you viewed. <laughs> Oh, look! Fairy lights. Oh, that's not showing up right. They're fairy lights. Should I? No! <laughs> oh, don't! Get thee behind me, Satan! No! I'm gonna close out of this. This app is dangerous. My goodness. My goodness! Ooh. What was I? What was I doing? Yeah, whatever. Her dynamite. Try and straighten my hair. Bought a lot of crap. I'm gonna be broke soon. Mmm. Felt good to film today. It was nice to be on set again. Of nothing. Of nothing that's important. It was. <laughs> that's not. Whatever I just said is not. Oh no. Oh no! And I don't know what else to say anyway. This is just a video about me hearing BTS on the radio. Yay. Boo boo. Ooh. Ayo. Hi, baby. Ooh, woo. My poor child. This is just an update vlog, I guess. Or whatever. Update. Yeah, she's hungry. I should go feed her.
Feed us, mother, for we are hungry. Okay, let it go. I'm gonna go now. <laughs> I don't know! Ah! Don't. Close enough. <laughs> Sending through the city with the little funky soul from a night in a black dynamite. Whoa! See, I don't even know all the words. So why am I doing? <laughs>